everyone, welcome to another episode of Zade Blade Escapades, and I'm here at a server that I don't know, I've never been on before. This is a new server. Oh, by the way, make sure you hit the sub button if you enjoy. It always does help the channel. But uh, there's a really cool guy who's been watching my videos and following me on Twitter, and he sent me a link. His name is JW or Jawii. J A W I A E. And uh, anyway, so these guys have been obviously full bore. Look, they've already got a diamond pickaxe, five diamonds, and this is also the new 1.6 version. So this is like hardcore, holy crap, we're going to die. Like full out craziness. But these guys have got it down right now. Look at this. They obviously have some source of water that's pouring from somewhere. You get those all the time, those little underwater pools. But these guys have absolutely been going full bore at it. Uh, so, I've heard they've just gotten a windmill, which is really cool. They've actually just started, but yeah, I mean, these guys are pretty far for just starting. Some chickens. Maybe I could feed the chickens. Should I feed the chickens? Hey, chickens, are you hungry? Yep, they're hungry. I should probably be there for the eggs, though. They've got some gold going. Snow. <laughs> hey, snowballs are good for something, right? Ah, uh, this is the hand grinding stone. I guess they did that to get to the point of the windmill, which I'm guessing is up here. And they've got hemp going. I might as well just collect some of this hemp for them, you know. Sorry if there's a little bit of a delay in the game. I don't have the best internet connection where I am. No fiber for me, and these guys are based in, I don't know, one of the players is from Norway. So, this might be pretty far from my location, so. It'll probably be fun fighting a creeper, I just make sure I won't do it at the base, for sure. Alright, let's go bring this stuff over here real quick. I like this base design, it's simple, yet functional. And I love how they've already started developing it. Like, the base is looking really nice. They haven't wasted any time in building roads, like me. It took me how many episodes to build my first road? Not these guys. Look at them. Holy cow. They have built roads. And it's really cool roads. I don't know why. I think this is so that you don't get hit by Endermen. I'm not sure. You can still get shot by skeletons, but there's definitely lots of stuff going in each place. And there's the pride and glory. The first windmill. And Better Than Wolves, if you don't play Better Than Wolves, by the way... You might not understand, or if you haven't watched the ser my, my Better Than Wolf series, you might not understand, but this thing is like, you've made it. Well, almost. It's like the main step to being able to semi-automate. Actually, it's the main step just being able to live. Really. That, when you, when you get to that stage, you know you can live. Because you can grind up all sorts of goodness. To, you know, bet bread and all that other kind of stuff to make sure you can live. I keep going through these chests hoping to find something new or I don't know what. Anyway, let's go down here. This looks really cool. So there's a little room down here. Not sure what they're doing here. Could be for egg killing. And I see this. We've done this on the Zade Blade server. Uh, 100 subscriber server. And I don't know how this works, but I'm thinking mobs can't go over it. I, I don't know how it works. They just, I guess they see that it's not usable for them. Uh, yeah. Oh, hold on. I've got Jan the Viking. It's just commented on my video that uh, they've resent the the like, Hold on a second, guys. Alright, guys. I am officially on the Discord server. Uh, doesn't look like anyone's on right now. But I've also updated to my texture pack. Only because I looked, and they've got a texture pack they use. I don't think it's this one, though. I want to go see their windmill. No, it's not this one. It's I think it's um, the John Smith texture pack, which I don't think I have. Oh, well. It would have been nice. And look, at the, these are growing pretty quick. I don't know what they've done to them, but yeah, they seem to be growing pretty well. Bookshelf. Oh, I know. That's the texture pack I'm using. Anyway, so that little thing down there is actually a way to their underground tunnels. And it looks like that's a way. This is actually a really cool starting place. I wonder if they found the tunnel first and then basically just dug in. And I like how they're using glass already. You know, they don't even have a... Uh, they don't even have a crucible. And they've already got glass. 
That's not me in my game. Like, on, on the Zadeblade server, yeah. Yeah, we've got glass. We had glass early on. And uh, Sebweb's been great at putting all those things up. As well as the rest of you who are a part of that server. It's looking great. And uh, I'll probably actually do a little server view of that as well, since we're doing servers at the moment. But yeah, this is a really cool server. I love how they've already built roads. I, I just... I can never seem to build roads. We did it on the server as well quick. It's just... I find that a lot of people who play, who play Better Than Wolves longer than I have, or maybe more than I have, um, tend to uh, really build the roads early on. And that's pretty cool stuff. I wonder where this leads. Like, there's obviously... Maybe these are like hardcore spawn roads. Yeah, it's probably what they are. It's as far as it's gotten. Ooh, what's over here? Oh, something just died and left. Oh, well. So I'm guessing that's what these roads are for. Hardcore spawn. But I do like them, and I like that they use gravel. Gravel's a cool thing to use, and they've used half-slapped gravel. It can be a pain to work with, but, uh... Wait, half-slapped gravel? Oh, yeah, yeah, I just haven't used it in ages. Um, and this is a cool bridge. It's a dirt bridge. Uh, it's a dirt bridge with half slabs over top of it, which is really cool. Well, I'm going to put my game volume up for a second. Um, okay, hopefully. Oh, that's so much better. Like, I know you guys could probably hear, like, what's going on, but, like, my ears were, like, hearing nothing. This is great. Look at this. I like how they built in a snow biome, too. Not many people build in snow biomes in Better Than Wolves because it is... It's it's a lot more difficult building in the snow biome, I'll tell you that much. And spawn is in the snow biome. Like, if I start a world, a brand new Better Than Wolves world, and I am in a snow biome... Yeah, so it looks like these are basically just long tunnels. I don't know, they could actually be, uh, like, mini bases, because um, I know several people from our server, the uh, Zadeblade server, um, have done that as well, has done that as well, have done that as well, made their own bases pretty early. I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna cut, I'm gonna talk to these guys for a second. I'm on their server, so I'm gonna talk to them, but I'll be right back with some more server stuff. <laughs> but these guys are apparently awake right now, and it's the middle of their day, so I'll be right back. All right, so, the, I mean, the server is is quite new. I'm back, by the way, in case you're wondering. The server's quite new. The guys are really cool. They're around the same age as me, which makes it cool as well. Um, I mean, hey, you know, Minecraft's one of those things that just spans... Like, seriously, you play it, and then you know. Because I, st I, th I thought it was the dumbest game I'd ever seen when I first saw it. And when, when this one kid told me when I, I was like, what, 26 at the time? He told me, and I was just like... <laughs> That's just the dumbest game. You place blocks and you walk around the world and fight zombies. That's dumb. And here I am, like, literally seven years later, still playing this, and it's my number one go-to game. Like, I try to get full-out graphics cards, and I want to get a 1080 and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> but, like, I play Minecraft, so it's like... Uh, yeah, you want that hardcore gamer stuff, but you're not playing hardcore games. But hey, the texture packs work nice. Look at these. I love this new texture. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Uh, I can't wait for it to be finished. Wink, wink. <laughs> Jokes, though. Seriously, no, it's, it's awesome. I love this texture pack. Okay, anyway, so we've uh, had a quick tour of the base. Um, I want to see these mine shafts. Ooh, I'm not going to... Uh, I'll take some eggs. Eggs are cheap. Well, they're not actually cheap yet, to be honest, because... We don't have a saw. So until we get a saw, we can't really put anything down there to catch them. Their stuff. So I guess that's what they're working on. Actually, we've got everything we need minus poop. We find a dog. Do they have poop? Did I miss it? Is there a secret hidden layer of poop here? I don't know. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I don't see any hidden poop. I do see lovely spider eyes. No, no hidden poop. I think that's I think that's the one thing they're missing is the poop and the cow hide. Well, it's hard to kill cows at this stage for real. Maybe that's something I can help them out with. I have ex expertise on killing cows. 
Not really. Not, oh, no, they do have tan leather. Okay. So I'm guessing they have killed some cows and did find some poop. So I'm guessing the thing that they're waiting on... Is that depleted? nuts? No, I'm hearing dudes. Um, I'm guessing what they're waiting on is just uh, maybe the iron. This is like their treasure dress, for sure. Look at all this. This one can get some more use. This one is just about dead. And obviously they keep their diamond pickaxe here. So I'm guessing these are a bunch of mates that play. And uh, yeah, so we'll probably do some more of this later when they're on. Or right now they're kind of at work, so maybe this is something I could do a bit more when I move to the States. And I am moving to the States, guys. Um, fun fact, when you don't live in the States and you're an American, you still have to pay taxes. So, if you didn't know that, go fill out your taxes. <laughs> I don't have to pay for taxes because I pay for them here in New Zealand, but I've got a file. So, I've got a whole bunch of filing I have to send out to the States to move back, so... Oh well, but when I move back, it means it's more in the time zone of most of the people that watch these videos. And I can live stream with you guys. That would be fun. Especially these guys. These guys sound like a good group of guys. They're really excited about Better Than Wolves. What can I say? I love people who are excited about Better Than Wolves. Ages ago, I tried to make my own mod. Try to make Minecraft better. And I thought, man, it'd be really cool if I could have, like, windmills and that kind of thing. And da 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 da. And all of a sudden, I just stumbled upon Better Than Wolves like six years ago and that's been my go-to go-to version or go-to game because it's not really just a version it's more than that all right, where do i put all this stuff boom boom these these oh pff, i hit the wrong thing you guys should start pooping out some eggs oh man i love this texture pack love the texture pack thank you thank you ion i believe it's ion who keeps it up to date on the forums uh and, oh and he did use my tree trunk my base tree trunk over there. And he did give me credit too. He didn't have to either. I was totally not... I was totally fine with him not giving me credit, but he gave me credit. And I love his artwork. It's doing good. Alright, anyway guys. Um, I did say I was going to go down and check that out. Let me just grab this shovel that I said. Still had some uses in it. Don't worry guys. I'll put it back. I swear. I'll put it back. I just want to have a look at the forbidden zones. Okay, what we got here? Is this just an... See, these guys do what I do sometimes. I didn't do it in this uh, current season of Minecraft, but I tend to do uh, to build mine shafts um, above this level here. So I'll often dig out in the direction, dig on either side to get to get iron. I actually, I may have done that in one of my videos. I don't know. I'll have to check. But yeah, I, I think I've done that in one of my videos. They have to have a portal, right? No, no, they don't have a portal yet. It's like, oh, this is a nice cavern. I don't, don't worry, I'm not. I'm trying. I'm trying not to lose your shovel here. Of course, if I like peek over the edge, I'm gonna die. Oh, look at all of that goodness. Some more iron. This is still the stage where you need iron from these places. This is a really nice cavern, guys. Seriously, holy cow. You guys struck it. Struck it rich. Although, I must say, I do... Oh, no, they have taken some. You can see it right there. Just don't... No, maybe, maybe it's all the way down here. Nether portals are something you've got to build far away from anything at Better Than Wolves, because, especially with the new update, there's all sorts of crazy stuff that, he's, that uh, Flower Child has put in. I don't even know half of it, but apparently... It gets even worse than just nether portals, so. And you can transfer souls of the dead to your animals and all sorts of crazy stuff like that. That's not good for your animals, <laughs> obviously. Not so bad for later game, those uh, that sort of thing. But, yeah. Alright, so these guys are really, uh, really going well so far. And I'll probably play with these guys at some point. Maybe just play on the server sometimes. I said I could record, which I'm doing now. So, yeah. Hey, hey, birds, why haven't you pooped out the eggs? Is it too late when I did it? Ah, <gasps> there they are. Yay. Good on you, chickens. Now let's come up here and check more. There we go. Look at that, I'm pulling my weight already, guys. I'm pulling my weight already. Alright, and then I'll just 
chuck my raw eggs in there. I'll put these eggs back for now until I get officially added to the server. You know, when the guys are on and they tell me what I can take and what I can't take. I just don't want to take all their stuff. Because they've worked hard to get this. Like, holy cow. They've done a lot of work. But man, I tell you what. Better Than Wolves is almost like a a version of Minecraft that you sort of have to play with a group of people. Otherwise, it's so slow like with my world. And my world's actually fast because it's it's this island. And I just keep spawning near my home base. Like the one time I spawned on a road I made. That was freaking wicked. Um, spoilers if you haven't seen that yet, but that was pretty wicked. Alright guys, well that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this quick little episode about this new little server that I will be playing on as well. And what we'll do real quick is I'll pop onto the other server, my, uh, my dude's server. Actually, my own server. And, uh, yeah, we'll pop on there and have a look around and be right back. Cheers.